as a part of this scam process. Um, I didn't I didn't feel good. Like sometimes when I try to sleep, the voices of the victims go round and round inside my head. Thank you for being connected with the Microsoft department. How can I help you? Hey, are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Okay. Right, what happened? I thought you answered the phone saying uh, Microsoft. Katum Pagalho, have you gone mad? Like, are you feeling okay today? Why would you think you work at Microsoft, sir? What, sir? what, what was the problem? Well, I don't have a problem. I'm here to help you. I want to help crazy people, people that think they work places they don't. You're pretending to work at Microsoft today. You're too crazy to understand that, but I can help you. Kamada Asinam Kyahe. He's not ready to be helped. For calling Amazon Hotel. Did you try the uh, personals and the telegraph at all? I mean, you can't find a boyfriend being people you in your country. Why did you call a second again? You must... Oh, you're upset, huh? <laughs> Stacy, hi. Uh, Sanjay wanted me to reach out to you. He's very concerned about you. How many men have you slept with today? He says you're, like, slotting it up everywhere. Are you going to be okay? Do you need my help? Talk Sorry, to me. I'm not getting you. Can you please repeat again? Yeah, uh, Sanjay is very worried about you. He says that you're, like, uh, fornicating with all these different men, and you're a dirty woman, and you don't like yourself. I'm here to help you. I'm going to boost your self-esteem. Tamara Asinam Kyahe. Let's start with your first name. I don't think she's ready to be helped yet, Sanjay. Thank you for calling support. This is Jacob. How can I help you? Hey, Jacob. Uh, is everything okay? Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, Sanjay told me to give you guys a call. He said maybe you were frustrated. Like you're Gandhi, right? And your parents don't accept your lifestyle. I'm here to help you. Yes, sir. Tell me. Okay. Yeah, tell you what? How I can help you? Talk to me. Sir, this is Amazon support. How can I help you, sir? Javab Do, Bevakuf. Tamara Asinam Kyahe. How long have you thought you worked at Amazon? Let's get to the root of the problem. Katum Pagalho. Are yar. So. Madam. Okay. have the order number. Go ahead, please. Sir, this is Amazon support. How can I help you? Keep saying that. You might believe it one day. I don't think anyone else believes you. Listen to that guy in the background talking to my friend right now. That guy in the background is talking to a fake customer. Did you know that? Tamara Asinam Kahe. I'm in your system right now. So, my name is Jacob. Kyakaha? Akinam Kahe? So, Jacob, my real name is Jacob, so... You can't even pronounce that word. Uh, Kya up in Greasy Botehe? It might be easier for you if you speak Hindi, but... Uh, I'll try. Whatever you want. I'm here to help you. So, uh, so, so, I'm not comfortable in Hindi. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh, my goodness, Bevaku. You really are stupid, huh? Okay, Muse Maf Karo. I can't help you, okay? I can't help you. I tried. Okay, for Okay, so. All right, go fuck yourself. Thank you for calling Amazon support. You're talking to Parker. Can I help you? Why do you sound so upset? Sir, I'm not sure what makes you say that, sir. Your voice, your tone, you? You, you sound very upset. Idni Duke Kyuho. Like, who am I speaking with? Tamara Asinam Kyahe? Sir, you're a motherfucker. Oh, what did I say that made you so upset? <laughs> I guess we shouldn't ask what's wrong. Thank you for calling support. This is Veronica. How can I help you today? Hello? Hello? Up on, hey. Listen to me, Rundy. Feed those kids. This is disgusting that you would do that with those kids in the background. Go feed those kids. That's the end of that conversation, everybody. Thanks for calling to Amazon. This is Adam. How can I help you? Oh, Adam, just the man I'm looking for. They told me to reach out to you. Are you frustrated today? Why are you so upset? No, I'm not frustrated. You didn't tell me what problem you are facing. Well, I'm a motivational speaker. I don't know if you know this. Uh, your boss told me to reach out to you. Uh, Tamara Asinam Kahe. Let me make sure I have the right Adam. A lot of you guys are using that name. Don't be shy. We're in a safe space. Adam? Let's get to the root of the problem. Why are you so frustrated? Hmm. Thank you for calling Amazon.
Tom's all. This is Sandra. How may I help you? Sandra, come on. You need to go back to the brothel. Make some money on your back. Stop hurting people. You sound ridiculous. What happened? You happened. What happened? Tomata asinam kahe, Sandra. Me happen? Like a very good dream? Oh, I dream about you every night. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah? You want a gift card? Shit. I don't want. Of course you do. Why would you sit there why would you sit there and pretend you want to work at Amazon and, and then you don't want money? You'd rather hurt people? <laughs> oh, she wants me. Definitely wants me. Thank you for calling support. This is Chandon. How can I help you? Listen to me, Michael. I pressed five about an hour ago. Why have I been on hold? I have some serious problems going on, Duck Sauce. Can you help me? What problem are you facing on the computer? Well, let's not worry about the computer. Let's worry about your hold system. I pressed five because I'm having a computer problem, and I've been on hold forever. What are you guys doing to me? This is no way to treat a customer. Oh, okay. I'm sorry for that. Are you sorry for that? Now I will fix your computer problem. Okay, thank you. Yes, I'm sorry for that. Yep, how will you fix it? You're going to give are me you instructions? Are you trouble with the computer now? I'm having trouble with the computer now. I'm yes. trying to tell you. What computer you're using? What's the make of the computer you're using, sir? I have an HP 550. Okay, look on the keyboard on the very left bottom corner. There is a Windows key down there. Do you see that? Oh, the one that looks like a little graph, like there's like four quadrants? Yes, press it. Just press and release it. I'm pressing it. Oh, my God. You fixed it. Now, you must be... Mm -hmm. Is that all I had to do the whole time was just oh, press that okay, button? that's great. I am so sorry to bother you. That worked fine. No. That worked great. Everything's uh, fine no. now. Thank you so much. I, di I didn't tell you that your computer is fixed. You told me how to fix it, though. Did you I tell you that your computer... I'm no. sorry? I didn't give you the complete instructions. You yourself are claiming that your computer is fixed. That button is, is gold. Is not fixed I yet. never I used that button. I never used that button before, and and then you told me about that button. You're a genius. Sir, it, yeah. believe me, you are a dumb ass. Kakaha? Call me again, you cocksucker. If I will come over there, I'll, come, I'll fuck you like a beast, let's, okay? Let's talk about that for a minute, Gandhi. You're not going to do anything. You're too poor. You're a fucking loser, and you're never coming to America. You can do. Do you know that? You're a Gandhi. Tomata asinam kiahe, fucker. Kiap and greasy bote hey. Bye. Thank you for contacting Microsoft Support. My name is Max. How may I help you today? Hey, buddy. Are you okay? I'm okay. Can you hear me properly? I can hear you properly. It sounded like you said thank you for calling Microsoft. Yeah. I'm from Microsoft, sir. You called Microsoft. Can you tell me yeah, I what think problem you're facing right now? I think you need my help. Katum Pagoho. You really think you work at Microsoft? Have you gone mad? Sir, why are you so exaggerated, sir? Can you tell me? Why am I so what? Exaggerated. What do you mean by that? Kakaha? Mujay Nahipata. I'm trying. Sir, uh, can we talk in English? I'm not able to understand you. Well, you can understand me, uh, but you have a very thick Indian accent, but that's okay. We'll get to the root of the problem. Uh, I'm trying to help you. you. You picked up the phone saying you work at Microsoft. We both know you don't. So the first yes, step sir. the first step to a problem is to admit that you have one. When did you start thinking you worked at Microsoft? Today? Or has this been an ongoing thing? Oh sure. It's been eight months I've been working in Microsoft, sir. Okay, so eight months you've been hurting innocent people pretending to work at Microsoft. Tell me about that. What was it like the first time you hooked up to somebody's computer and took a screenshot of their bank account and put somebody on the phone with the victim? Uh, who said that they were the bank. Can you talk about that? How did you feel? Sir, I don't know what you're telling me about. Again, you're in a safe space. Do you want to get to the root of the problem or not? I mean, don't lie to yourself. You can try to lie to me, but I already know about you. Tamada Asinam Kyahe. Sorry? Come again? I'm trying to help Come you, again? sir. I'm trying to help you. Can you please talk about it? Like, do you ever feel bad being a scammer and saying that you work at Microsoft is unbelievably stupid? You must feel like the biggest loser uh, ever. Okay, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Tell yeah. me about it. How much longer will you pretend to work at Microsoft? 
two years. You're going to do this for another two years? You're not afraid of going behind the bars? Have you seen what's been happening over there in Noida and in, in New Delhi in Kolkata? Scammers are getting arrested left and right. Are you not afraid of that? I am. It's easy money. Right. Well, it's easy. It's always easy money. It, like, you, you can get easy money, but any day could be your day. And not only that, you have bad karma coming your way. You know that. You, you hurt innocent people. That has to take a toll. That's not what's going on, sir. Of course it is. You know what's going on. You're hooking up to people's computer, telling them that you're Microsoft, and, and taking money from their account. That's what's going on. And again, you could try to lie to me, but I already know. Talk about it. You'll feel better. I mean, you have to feel like a piece of shit, knowing that you rob from innocent people every single day. Some of them have killed themselves because of you. That has to hurt, no? All right, I don't think you're ready to talk right now. And and we're not really making any progress here. We can't talk. Not if you're not truthful, though. You have to be truthful with me. All right. I'm going to give you a very confidential information. If my owner finds out about that, I'm done. Either I'm dead or I'm jobless. Are you, are you listening to me? I'm listening to you. This call is getting recorded. Everything uh, I'm speaking, my owner and their colleagues, all of them monitor the calls. So eventually, in one or two days, they'll they'll come to know about um, what I'm talking with you. And like, I want to stop it. Like, not only me, I want to stop what's going on. Like, well, you know what I'm trying to say? Not not only like. As a part of this scam process, um, I don't, I didn't feel good. Like sometimes when I try to sleep, the voices of the victims go round and round inside my head.